This is me, it's Queen Elsa Heru, and thank you for joining me for another wonderful edition of Ask an Aquarius. If you haven't already, please hit the red subscribe button and smack the bell. So I've been getting a lot of messages from Aquarius the last couple days, especially, and I've gotten some of these in the past, telling me that they feel like they, their friends and strangers feel like they're their therapist like everybody comes and just dumps their stuff on us they come to aquarius and you know they have you know all these problems or issues or need advice and they come to the aquarius and a lot of aquarius carry this vibration and a lot of people will come to us and ask us for help or for advice or that kind of thing um a lot of times perfect strangers one time when I was in my early 20s, before I even thought about being a priestess, um, I was sitting on the bus and there was a man, he got on next to me. I didn't really pay him much mind. And I was, you know, sitting there minding my own business. And the next thing I know, this man starts crying on my shoulder. I looked over like, <laughs> like, what are you doing, you know? And he was just crying. So I started to, you know, pat him on his shoulder. And I said, you know, what's wrong? And he started to tell me how he had just come from the hospital and had been diagnosed with diabetes. And he was very upset about it. And he, you know, about the whole thing, basically, he was just upset about it. And he was venting to me about his feelings. And I sat and I listened to him and we talked about it. And it was wonderful. Every time, and, and come to find out, he lived around the corner from me. I had never seen him before. He was an older man about my mom's age. And every time I saw him after that, he would come up and hug me and, hey, how are you? And we had such a positive vibration. But it was all because that day on the bus, when he was a complete stranger that burst into tears on my shoulder. So Aquarius, you carry what I call a humanitarian vibration. So many of us, unless there's another vibration that overrides it, many of us will have this happen. Our friends, uh, strangers, you know, will come to us and ask for help. And basically, you have to help when you can and you have to recharge. Like I told you before, that's how we lose a lot of our chi is doing stuff like that. A lot of Aquarius even work in humanitarian, you know, in humanitarian work. I used to always work at nonprofit. That was my thing, you know. So a lot of us do that kind of work. And even if we don't do that kind of work, we have friends, we have family members who come at us with that energy. The one girl says she doesn't think it's fair because what she'll help someone else and she can't get that energy back. And I said, well, you just have to, I'm like, you have to find someone who you can get that energy from. You have to find your own Aquarius, maybe, you know, you have to find somebody who you can get that energy from. Because honestly, that's not the energy of any in everybody. Like people will be like, well, so-and-so doesn't even listen to my problems. Everybody's not built like that. First of all, they're not built to really listen to them or really have any answers, any solutions. So if you find yourself always giving, 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 giving in that way, giving advice, giving help, giving logic, giving reason to situations, then you that means you need somebody that you can go to. You need your own mentor. You need your own Aquarius. You need your own counselor, therapist, whatever. You need somebody that can give you that energy. And also, Aquarius, this is how we lose a lot of our chi. So you have to make sure that if you are, you know, helping people as needed, that you are replenishing your chi. That's why a lot of us go off by ourselves all the time and need so many breaks, because it's like we're being drained by these energies. A lot of Aquarius have spiritual abilities. A lot of us are empaths. Some of us are just, you know, straight up humanitarians. That energy is draining especially when you deal with big groups of people. When I taught high school, I used to be drained all the time because you're teaching, you know, classes and you're seeing students in the hallway and you got to deal with the adults in the building. I was drained all the time. After work, I had no energy. I would just lay in the bed and just stare at the TV, you know. I would just be drained. And that is what happens to us when we do that. So Aquarius, you are going to get expected you, if you carry that vibration, you are going to be expected to help, to give advice. You know, people are going to blurt out their life stories to you. Sometimes you're going to be sitting there like, what did I do to deserve all this? Nothing. It's just your vibration. So I would suggest 
that you just help the person to move on, you know, give them some logic, give them some reason. Some people just need somebody to listen. They don't even want logic and reason. They just want you to listen. Just intuit what they need from you. Do they need logic? Do they need a solution? Do they just need you to listen? Intuit what they need, give them that and move on. And it's up to your discretion. You might not want to do that with everyone. I don't do that with everyone. I do it with people that I, f I feel a vibe like, yeah, talk to this person. You know, I feel it. So Aquarius, go by your gut. If you feel like, okay, this person needs my help, then help them. If you have friends that are constantly taking advantage of this, that's something y'all need to communicate about. You need to talk to them about that and be like, you know, I would tell them. I would wait until a time when they're in a good space and I would tell them, you know, I really don't, um, I really don't mind helping you, you know, through your situations, but it just feels like I don't get that energy back from you. It feels like when I need you, I can't get that energy from you. I would just tell them a lot of the questions that people ask me and ask in Aquarius are all about having an honest conversation. I've noticed that a lot of people are afraid to have honest conversations and communicate with the people that they know, their loved ones, their friends, their family. A lot of times it's out of fear. But Aquarius, we have to get over that fear and start to talk. Because what happens is, is that you're going to start ghosting those people. People that keep on needing stuff repeatedly, those are the people that we ghost. Some of them, it's okay to ghost because of the fact that they're constantly needing and they're not giving. If it's not a reciprocal relationship and you've talked to them about it, then I could understand you pulling away from the relationship. But you have to say something first, Aquarius. You can't just be like, look, they don't, they're not reciprocal, I'm out. A lot of times you just have to talk about it. A lot of people will change their behavior if you talk to them about what's hurting and upsetting you. Okay? So yes, Aquarius, we are the humanitarians and sometimes the therapists of the world. And that can be a good thing, especially if it's your profession. If you um, make that, if you have that vibration and you have a profession of being the humanitarian, of being that kind of energy, it can at least be good for your job. It might be draining, but it can be good for your job and make you successful in your job. So that is something that we do. And like I said, you do it on your terms based on when your gut draws you one direction or another. And have conversations with your loved ones. Let them know how you feel about it. Okay? If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Okay? And if you want to donate, my PayPal will be underneath this video. If you would like to get your own tarot or oracle card reading, my email will be under here and you can make an appointment through my email. And also, if you want to get a free answer to a question, any general question I will answer, all you have to do is email me or put it in the comment section. If you know somebody who might benefit from my video, please pass it on to them as well. Thank you.